Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's Nash. For today's video, we're actually doing a bonus cash stuffing. So I wanted to stuff it along with you guys and just chit chat, update you guys on what's been going on and go from there. So let's get into it. I decided I went to the bank this morning and I just put the money in here since we got it. We got the exact denominations that I was looking for. So I wasn't playing, but let's count to see what we're working with. So one, two, three hundred. So this is the amount that we're stuffing in cash. Um, I also put money aside for my car taxes, which was two fifty, dollars which I already paid for July. So my car tags are all set for the rest of the year. And I also put money aside for my savings. So this is basically the remaining in cash. So let's get into it. All right. Um, we'll start off with bills because that's what I have first on my list. I decided to just treat it similar to like a paycheck so I'm able to get a little bit ahead and split the second half into two parts, if that makes sense. So for some of them, so we'll get into it. So we don't need to put anything in these. For phone, I'm going to be putting... seven which is my full payment so we have 50 70 80 85 86 87 so my phone bill is all set for the month of july rent instead of putting what is this 470 in here um i just took the second half which would have been like 468 or something like that and i divided it by two so we're actually putting 234 because my rent is 935 oh wait i grabbed one um my rent is 935 but with with the money order fee it basically brings it up to 938 so that's basically what i'm putting aside so we have 100 200 20 30 1 2 3 4 okay so now i can mix it in here because i don't know why it was so difficult for me to do it okay let's see how much we got now in rent 100 200 300 400 500 600 20 40 60 80 90, uh, I don't even remember. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 700, 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. So, quick math. We have 704, 704 minus, yep. So for my next paycheck, I will only have to put 234 aside. So that's gonna be great. Love it. I love, 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 love it. So for Roxy, which is my car payment and um and health and I mean it's my car payment and my insurance for my car. So 80 is being put aside, which is my car payment is 320, so half technically would have been 160, so I'm putting 80. Actually, I did it this way. Okay, so I'm gonna be putting 80 for my car payment and 85 for my insurance. So we have 165, so I'm actually gonna do 250s. 120, 40, 60, 5, okay. I have 100, 200, 20, 40, 65. So now, on my next check, I'll basically be putting the same amount aside as well. 
subscriptions will be getting 34. So we have 20, 40, what? 20, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 34. So I put 10% of my hourly check bonuses. I do not put tithe aside for. So Wi-Fi will be getting 34 as well. Now you guys can understand why I have so many singles. One, two, three, four. Now Wi-Fi is 76 a month. 20, 30, one, two, three. 34 for my internet. Perfect, okay. So, all of the bills have been stuffed. Just wanted to make sure that I was good um, for my bills versus just putting all of it towards like sinking funds and stuff like that. So, I'm just trying to be an adult and being smart. I decided to put a little bit towards some of my envelopes so let me so for groceries i have seven and i'm putting 13 so that i can get back up to 20 just so i can um in case i need to grab any miscellaneous things from now till what you call it from now till my paycheck that i'll be getting next week um, since I didn't actually give myself the full amount that I normally would from my last paycheck. And then here we have 20, 2, 3, 4, 5, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So I'm actually going to bring it up to 35. I mean, this stays. So I basically added the difference. So I'll put these ones here. So we now have 20, 35. Okay. And household is getting 10. This is for any toiletries that I may need, I am running, I'm starting to run low now through my couponing stockpile, so I need to get um, soap, like body wash. Fun money, I am putting 10 here. <clears throat> so I'll actually just do a 10. So we have 10, 20, 25, perfect. Love, 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 love to see it. Okay. So, for spending, this is... I'm going to just put this off to the side because I'm actually going to need that envelope in a moment. So, let's get into some of my savings. So, I actually came out with some new envelopes, if you didn't know. So, it's these, like, half... This is how it looks. So it's these that the logo is like split in half. So the label is it's kind of like inverted, I guess you can say. And I really like how they came out. So I ended up just making a new. These are the samples that I made for the listing. And I just ended up making all the categories that I wanted. So for apartment, we're going to start off with a solid 20. There's a few things that I've been wanting to get. And... I feel like I go through phases of wanting to build it, but um, there's a few things I have my eyes on, so I need to start putting money aside so I can, you know, invest in my apartment on things that I feel like are necessary now that I basically bought the most basic or most affordable option just when I was on my own, but now I want to invest in a little bit better quality items in my home, if that makes sense. <clears throat> Beauty will be getting 10. I want to just put a little bit aside in case I start running low on some of my makeup and beauty related things. For 
car maintenance, I'm putting a 10, so we now have 30. I'm in a desperate need of a car wash, so I will definitely be using this soon. Gifts will be getting 40. Perfect. And then shopping actually is like an extension or sinking fund of this envelope. So my spending is what I've been using. I've been putting money aside. So if you saw the lash cash stuffing, I put 125, I believe, aside for new clothes because I got a new job and I need some new work wear, business casual, like banker type clothing. And this is kind of like what I got remaining, but I am going to be putting another 125 because there are some more things that I want to get. So, um, hold on, what do I got here? Um, hmm. So, what I'm going to do is put this here so I can get myself a 50. So in total, for shopping, we now have 150, which I feel like will be great. I've been able to find some nice staple pieces, but I am missing, I'm gonna get a few pants and a blazer or cardigan. All right, so we finally are gonna be starting my savings challenge. From this bonus, I'm actually gonna be putting 50 aside. So I'm going to do 24, 10, 20, 20, so we have 10, 20, 25, 30, okay, I didn't since I condensed some of my envelopes, it's like all messed up, but I just didn't want to have like singles and smaller bills in my wallet. So let me make sure. So we have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Okay, I may condense this down if I have a chance for just so that I can have smaller bills here. But I decided to start off strong with the biggest amount. And I'm gonna try to get creative on how I can actually stuff these. Not just use like my paycheck, but I considered a bonus as an exception. So I'm trying to find, I'm gonna just take this fine point pen and I'm gonna mark off that we did 50. Okay, so that is it for my savings. With what's left, we are going to be stuffing some of my 100 envelopes, which I'm really happy. I haven't had a chance to add into here, so we have $50 and then we have a few singles that I'm gonna be putting somewhere else um, until we can reach a, another envelope amount. But I'm gonna just be picking to see how many I can stuff. So we pulled out a 10. One, another 10. Oh, what's this one? This is 50, so I don't have enough to do that one. This is 12. That's three. It's another 50. Okay. Have another 10. I'm going to see if I can pull out some fives versus doing a lot of 50s left. How many singles do I have left? One, two, three. Mm. Trying to find. It's 15. Yeah, that's 15. 10, 10, 10. 18. I don't think I have any other ones. Oh, look, I found a five. I wanted to do 
One, two, three, four, five. Oh, okay. Do we have another five? I'm not really being, um, end up doing a 15 but I wanted to try to do a bunch so that I could find another five yeah okay we'll do 15 because we have three fives for 15 boom and then these two what I'm gonna do is put them in my jar my change jar and then if I accumulate a few other singles, let's say I make it to five or to 10, I'll add it in here as well. But these $2, to be honest, I'm gonna just put them here. I'll put them here and then when I have more, I'll use that. So we have one, two, three, four, five. We still have a ways to go, but we're heading in the right direction. So, boom. And I can close you up. This is all good to go as well. Just like that, we are all set. I am so honestly grateful that I was able to get this bonus check because it's definitely giving me a head start, not only in my bills, but just in general, especially with the switch in careers and job-wise. I wanted to make sure that I was able to at least be proactive when it comes to my finances and set myself up for success so I'm not stressed and overwhelmed as I'm in the training phase trying to get you know accustomed to the new job and all that so I'm feeling really good and yeah I think that's it so thank you guys so much for watching I hope that you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next one bye